There's a number of different possibilities um, after a couple has um, undergone a psychological evaluation with me. Um, one of them is, and most of the time what we see is that they're cleared psychologically. Uh, there's no real pass-fail, if you would, in the psychological evaluation. Although I think most of our couples uh, come into the psych eval feeling like I'm going to fail them or <laughs> that's what I'm there for, and I'm really not. I'm there to protect them and uh, protect the surrogate, the agency, and everybody involved with the process. Um, so um, I would not typically reject people right out unless there was some major flags both in the clinical component as well as the psychological test um, that said to me, this is not going to work well for this couple. However, uh, most of the time they're cleared psychologically. Other times um, they may have to wait uh, several months, maybe three months, maybe six months, and come for a reevaluation um, to start the program. Uh, sometimes um, a couples will um, score on the test in a way that after my clinical component with them, I feel that they have misunderstood the questions. So I may actually go back and call them to go through sort of items, if you would, to see if they meant what they actually endorsed. Sometimes they misunderstand the question. So uh, that is testing the limits, if you would, and in that case it would clarify for me that yes, uh, they're okay to start the program or they need to wait longer uh, either way.